Hey, howdy, hey partners. Today I decided to do an OG review and do a Toy Story Collection 2009 Cloud Pattern Woody review. Let's get into it. You're watching Today I Grew Up. Hey partners, most of my views come from non-subscribers, so please consider subscribing today. Hit that alert so you'll be notified for future videos. It helps me as I'm on my way to 100,000 subs this year. Really appreciate it. Hey partners, welcome back to my channel. If you haven't already, please subscribe, hit that notification bell so you're alerted for future videos. As I'm on my way to 100,000 subs this year, really appreciate your support. I also have a new members join button where I'm offering exclusive content, so check out that join button if you want to be a member. Let's get into the review. I never did this review because I saw other YouTubers do it like 10 years ago, and I thought, well, why do I need to do it? 100 YouTubers did it. But now that I'm known for Toy Story, it makes sense that I should do this review. This is the OG 2009 Wave 1, Toy Story Collection Woody. You can't buy him in the stores anymore. Um, 2009 was the year to get him. That's where I got him from Target, I believe. I'm not really sure, but I'm pretty sure it was Target or Toys R Us, one of those. And I'm really happy. This is the best Woody you can buy from Thinkway Toys, unmodded. He's got real denim jeans, which we'll get into. But yeah, let's just first take a look at the box, the certificate of authenticity, and then we'll get into Woody himself. This box is full of nostalgia. It is a little beat up for the years, but you know, I still love it. It's Woody's Roundup. John Lasseter had said this is what we envisioned the box to be if Woody's dad found him in the toy store back then. As we know, he was Woody's, uh, as we know, Woody was Andy's dad's toy that was passed down to him. And this is a really nice box. It has the cloud logo later changed to white and then signature. But this is the original box, which I really love. You have Woody's Roundup on the side with the cactus detail. Really like that. And then the back says, Talking Figure Holster Collector's Edition, 50 sayings, pull string for original toy phrases. You're my favorite deputy. Reach for the sky and there's a snake in my boot and more. Pull my string. And then here it says, or talk to Woody and he'll respond and interact with you. So you can talk to him. He will talk back, say some fun phrases. And then here's the instructions. He takes two AAA batteries and the certificate of authenticity. So it's a really nice box. Um, it's it's crazy that on eBay these go for over $400 now if you get cloud pattern so definitely very expensive now but I will always keep this box. This is my original certificate of authenticity. As you can tell it is kind of faded now. It's just a cardstock um, and it's very old now. This one actually has John Lasseter's name on it as the director. In later years they changed this to Josh Cooley now and there's more stuff in the <laughs> In the certificate of authenticity, I have more words, but back then it was just very simple. It says, this definitive Woody is a certified replica lovingly produced by Thinkway Toys using digital data from the world's first full-length computer animated film. I hope you enjoy it as much as I enjoyed creating the character. It says, hey, howdy, hey, there's Woody. So yeah, I really like the certificate of authenticity. Because it says John Lasseter, it's just, it's old school. And it's very, very cool to have this uh, part of toy history. And here's Woody with his polyvinyl stitched hat, except it's cloth. <laughs> and he has this fun expression on his face. He has a nice vest. It's not super short, but it's it's there. He's got his gold buckle, his holster, his buttons, and his real denim jeans, which I wish they could have made in later waves, but they did not. And his stand. He measures at 15.5 inches without the hat. With the hat, he's 16 inches tall. So that's how you know you have a cloud. Woody, he is a taller Woody than all the other versions that they did release out there. One thing that always bothered me was the hat has two holes here because that's how it was tied in the package. I don't like that. And uh, obviously this could be vinyl, but you know, it's still a nice hat. It is Woody's hat and it fits on his head, so I can't complain about that. The one thing I don't like about the stand because of the box to save space, they made it flip. Sometimes this is still fine, it still holds, but over time it could wear really easy. It's kind of a cheaper plastic. Here on the neck, I actually bent this on purpose. As you can see the stress marks there, I actually bent it open because I noticed when I had Woody sitting on this uh, display stand after a while, as you see his neck started getting marks right there where it was squeezing his neck too tight. You can barely tell, but I can. So that's something to keep in mind with Woody if you get him. Uh, just make sure it's not too tight. So that's why I opened it and loosened it because then it grips his neck not as tight so you won't get those weird marks on his neck. Um, but you know, that's wear and tear of an older toy. 
and it's bound to happen. Woody himself is, is using digital Pixar data, so we can't argue that it's still authentic. It's just a more of a live mode expression. He does have the hairlines painted very nicely. These toys age like fine wine, so, you know, with time, you know, he, he has faded a, a tad, but he still has really blushy rose cheeks. And that was something that was missing in later waves for Woody. Signature, he kind of lost his coloring and it was more flat and there wasn't as rosy cheeks as the cloud pattern. So that's why I prefer the cloud pattern Woody because he has rosy cheeks and it's you can really tell that. And the rest of him is good. His vest, like I said, could be better. The Brazil version, I remember, was a lot shorter like that. And I think that would have been more movie accurate. These are longer vests. So yeah, that's why people mod them now. And the badge is really nice, but it's just very plain. There's no texture to the badge. It's just a flat gold. And it does say Sheriff. And it's still a nice badge, but it's definitely not movie accurate. The buttons are pretty nice. They're cheaper plastic, though. And then the gold belt buckle, I wish it was more yellow like the film. But at least it matches the holster. The holster has this fake ruby and the um, gold detail. And then his denim jeans. Are, these are real thick jeans. If you feel them, you can tell right away that these are not printed on. These are real denim jeans, which is probably expensive for the company to produce. And then there's pockets right here. He has real pockets. So that's a really cool detail that I really love. So it's a really nice Woody. Um, there's just so many great things about this that Thinkway Toys did. Obviously the pull string is too big. I wish they could have given us a smaller one. Take a closer look at the boots with the gold detail. It looks really nice. You have the inlay of the cactus there. I've seen some people add black wash to make that pop, but it's pretty nice anyways. The bottom, it's blank, so you can write your own name, as this was designed to be your Woody from Thinkway Toys, so they want you to put your own name, and that's why it doesn't say Andy's name on it. So now let's see what his OG toy mode phrases are when you pull his string. So those are his phrases. I really like them. I just wish they would have said um, somebody's poison the water hole. They did not include these in these toys. I don't know why. I know Disney Store did it in 2018. That was rare. So the voice is Jim Hanks. It's Tom Hanks' brother. It, it's He did a good job. It does sound like Woody for the most part. And I really like the phrases. Now we're going to do the play mode. So if I talk to him, he's going to respond to me. So we will see what that looks like. And what the responses are from Woody. I'm not going to go through all 50, but we'll see what he says back to me. Woody. Ha <laughs> ha, boy, am I glad to see you. What's new today? What are you up to? There's nothing like riding through town with my favorite deputy. Am I really? Your... That's you, partner. Oh, so I am your favorite deputy, right? What else is going on, Woody? ha right him, cowboy. Do you know where Bullseye is? What else is on your mind, Woody? A sheriff always wears his badge with pride. Wait, is your last name Pride, like Woody Pride? Hey, howdy, hey. hey, what's up, Woody? I'm here. Are you alive? Talk to me. When there's trouble on the prairie, I'm your sheriff. Where's Jesse and the Prospector? If there's one thing I've learned about being a sheriff, it's that you're only as good as your favorite deputy. What other advice do you have to give? Woody, tell, tell me more. And since you're my favorite deputy, I must be the best sheriff around. Cool, Woody. What do you want to say to my fans out there on Today I Grew Up channel? Say, partner, what do you want to do today? Talk to the fans of Today I Grew Up on YouTube. Well, pull my string. Yeehaw! Let's get to 100,000 subs this year, Woody. Woody agrees. Thanks, Woody, for talking to the fans. This town ain't big enough for the two of us. What? <laughs> what am I saying? Of course it is. Yeah, you better say that. If if anybody's leaving, it's hey, not going to... partner, you've got a friend in me. Okay, I'm glad we settled our fight. You're doing good, Woody. Thanks for talking to the audience. Come on, partner. It's time for a roundup. Any last words to the audience? One more thing for the fans.
There you have it, a very historical look at the 2009 Toy Story Collection Woody. He's a lot of fun, he has toy mode, he has a live mode so you can interact with him as you saw, and he's just an overall great quality toy. If you can buy him on eBay for 400 bucks, that's probably the max I would pay for a brand new mitten box cloud pattern Woody. They're definitely priceless to me and I just really enjoy collecting them. And I'm never going to sell them or mod this one because I want to keep one factory just like Thinkway Toys sent us. As always partners, thank you for watching, for liking. Please hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell so you're alerted for future videos. As I'm on my way to 100,000 subs this year, I appreciate the support. And I'll see you partners on the next video review. You want the real buzz like you? You're, a, no, you're an action figure. You are a sad, 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 strange little man. You are a sad, 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 strange little man. You are a child plaything. Hey, Ham, look, I'm Picasso. I don't get it.